appreciate it. It's nice to you. Thank you. What was that? Mr. Harlan, Emma, she pushed Madison down the stairs. What? James, help me! Emma just pushed me down the stairs! Emma, what did you, you do? You killed my baby! James, <laughs> you've got to get Madison to the hospital right now. That child inside her is the last thing we have of your brother. No, Grandpa, it's not what it looks like. I didn't do it. How could you do that to an unborn child? I didn't. Madison did it. Chloe! <sighs> Grandpa, if James doesn't know how to discipline his wife, I'll do it for him. <sighs> Emma, your marriage between James is over. Everything for James. Why doesn't he protect me? Are you sorry for what you did? James. Are you sorry for what you did? Am I sorry for what I did? No, I didn't do anything wrong, James. Why don't you ever believe me? I'm your wife. I should have never married you. Well, that makes two of us now. And I'm leaving you. I don't want a divorce. Good. Don't regret it. Are you finally leaving, bitch? If it wasn't for you, Madison would have married James years ago. Like she should have. Well, you know what? Now she can. Your mother and I have gone out of our way to keep your secret identity. We sent you abroad to chase your artistic dreams. You had a successful career abroad. Why would you leave that behind? To marry James Harland? I told you that was gonna be a mistake. Sweetheart, I know you don't want anything to do with the family business. And you don't wanna be associated with us everywhere you go. But your blood is Winston blood. So please, move home. Live with us again. I thought I loved him, Dad. I really did. Did he put his hands on you? Ethan, call the police. It's not necessary. You say the word, Emma, and I'll make him pay. What's wrong? They think that I caused Madison's miscarriage. They want to sue me and take everything I have left. Well, what are you going to do now? I need you to do me a favor, Ethan. Name it. I need you to let me borrow Megapower Media. I want revenge. I told you she was a fighter. You want revenge? On James Harlan? No, on every single one of them. Now that's a Winston. Sir, welcome back. It's confirmed she is officially single. I've been waiting for this day for so long. Sir, I'd say it's the perfect time to go after Miss Peterson. Not yet, Larry. It's more complicated than you think. Welcome to the Harlan Group's Autumn Product Launch. Please take your seat. Now, let's start with a sneak peek of the long-awaited product lines from the Harlan Group. Awesome. 
up. James doesn't love her. Where'd you get it? You didn't push me down the stairs. I lost my child. What do you think James is saying? All I have to do is tell him I've been you. Peterson, it's done. The video will be everywhere in less than an hour. Excellent. I hope Madison likes my get well gift. That fucking bitch! Grandpa, that video was fabricated. All right, quiet. Where is James? Tell him to get Emma here now. I'm working on it, Chloe. Stop fucking calling me. Frank, get in here. Mr. Harlan, tell PR to take that fucking video down now. We tried, um, but uh, it was already requested for release by the CEO of <sighs> Mega Power Media. Stop fucking calling me! How does Madison like my get well gift? Emma, this was you. Emma, Emma, fuck! This is slanderous to this family. Now, I don't care if you are divorced or not. She needs to publicly apologize and admit her mistake. I'll see what I can do. <laughs> Fuck, I'm so fucked. How did she even get that footage? So it's true, isn't it? James. I can explain. Do you think I'm a fool? Pack your stuff. I'll have someone send you a bride tomorrow. No, James, please, please don't send me away. James, I love you. Emma, you bitch. You fucking bitch. You will regret this. Mr. Harlan, we've looked everywhere, but we cannot find Emma's whereabouts. So you're telling me my ex-wife just vanished in thin air? Sir, we have scoured the entire city, but we have no idea where she is. <sighs> Miss Peterson, your revenge has officially begun. What do you want our strategy to be for this negotiation? It will be tough. Mr. Roberts, the contract has been reviewed. Here are some thoughts from our new CEO on a few clauses. Actually, Mr. Harlan has insisted on joining us to negotiate personally with Mega Power Media. Awkward. Mr. Harlan, this is Miss Peterson. She is the new CEO of Mega Power Media. Mr. Harlan, pleasure to meet you. Mr. Harlan, take a look at the contract. Ms. Peterson has some suggested modification in terms of future collaborations between the company. You call this a few modifications? Of course, Mr. Harlan might need some time to read over it. We can reschedule the meeting. Emma? Oh my god, how do you have the nerve to show your face around here? You owe the Harlans an apology. Oh, why can't I be here? Do you own the place, Chloe? Do you know what they're saying about us in the media? You've completely ruined our reputation! You are so spoiled, Chloe. It's time you learn some manners. <gasps> this is your lucky break. Save it. This is your lucky break. Save it. James, did you see what she just did? She pushed me and broke my arm. What's gotten into you, Emma? Oh, so now my ex-husband decides to show some interest in me. I am done with you. Get out of my way. James, what are you doing? Just let her go. <gasps> James, you're just gonna stand there and watch her bust my chops? I'll bust your credit card in half. Chloe, how about that?
Grandpa, Emma's trying to destroy your family's reputation. You can't just let this happen. How could you just let her walk away? You bring that wretched woman back and make her apologize. We're divorced, Grandpa. It's a free country. She can do whatever she wants. So what? She apologizes or I put her in jail. 